Karens are known for their public freakouts, and boy, do they deliver. They can be seen going off on anyone, from store clerks to restaurant staff, and even complete strangers. From screaming at the top of their lungs to pointing their fingers aggressively, these Karens know just how to make an entrance. So the next time you encounter a Karen in public, think twice before you startle her. She might just have something up her sleeve. One thing that is extremely common among entitled Karens is that they don't think that rules and consequences apply to them. But what happens if these same entitled Karens get arrested? Well, we're about to see what it looks like. Our first case involves Karen and Karen's husband. Without giving too much away, Karen is being accused of doing something to her husband that involves a suitcase. Now, detectives have brought Karen in for questioning to see if she's really that evil. So he had some injuries to his left shoulder. He had a cut near his like lip. You could see his mouth was a little uh, I haven't laid a hand on him. Okay. Um, what, what about the scratches? Because there's also sex. Yes. Okay. Because there's also like a like a scratch on like the back of his neck, like kind of like going, but it's like going straight across. I have no idea what that's from. In all okay. honesty, all honesty, we have not gotten into it. Okay. That's why, like, the only thing I thought you guys were going to ask me about, which I was going to be honest with you anyway, are the scratch marks on his back. Mm -hmm. Everything else, I have no idea what it is. Yesterday, when we took photographs of your overall body. Um, and they did the buccal swabs. Did they go under your fingernails? No. Okay. Are you willing to let us absolutely swab underneath your fingernails? Go for it. Do I have to watch this? I continuously throw up. I don't sleep. I don't want to see it, if that's okay. Well, it's on your phone, and you can either explain it or we take it for what it is. Yeah. We're just trying to give you the opportunity to tell us what's going on. That's it. For everything you've done to me. That's you, Sarah. your voice. Stupid. Sarah. It's my name. Don't wear it up. Sarah. I don't want to watch it, please. down. So in order for him to have gotten into it, it was flipped up. Right. It was flipped up normal. Yeah. Like as if you're packing something. So this is upside down. Guys, this is killing me right now. I don't mean to sound negative and I don't know if I can say this, but <coughs> like it's like you guys are kind of trying to like feed me. Like No, I'm just trying to show you a video that you no longer want to watch because you probably don't want to know the outcome of how and what you said. Well, I know what you know, you know what's on that video now? No. You remember making that video? No. Oh. Why don't you remember making the video? Probably because we had been drinking. But you weren't drunk. No. What do you think is going to happen if you leave somebody in a confined space like that? <clears throat> well, I thought by not zipping it up all the way, it would be okay. My plan was not to leave him in the and suitcase. what was your plan? Waiting for him to come upstairs. And then so when he did it? I fell asleep. You said you were up there 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, somebody not coming up. I Knowing that you that the last time you saw him was in the suitcase, 30 minutes later, you're like, mm, maybe I should go check on him. Maybe I shouldn't. No. Well, you See, didn't, that didn't cross your mind because that's it like didn't an, That's like an assumption. Like that's what you all are thinking. Just we're asking. It's the drinking. You promise and swear that everything we talked about today has been true and accurate to the best of your knowledge. Yes, that it was not intentional. Okay. Okay. All right. Do me a favor. Stand up. Why is this happening? Because George is dead. Not intentionally. We understand that. He's still dead. Well, we don't. Someone really needs to call Brian, please. Okay. Or can I not make a phone call? <coughs> You'll be able to make a phone call when we get you down to the jail. So why is this happening? So this was a trick. No, it's not no, a trick. Not How a was trick. a trick? Your response to everything was 
basically, I didn't do it. Intentionally. Okay, that doesn't matter. You're still there. Karen was ultimately charged with second degree murder and is facing life in prison. As of the date of this upload, the case is still pending. Having said that, this next Karen is a real handful. She was accused of hitting her ex-husband with a car, and when the police came to arrest her, watch out. She went into full Hurricane 5 Karen mode. Step out. Excuse me. Excuse Step out. Me. No, excuse me. Put Step out. Put your hands off of me. Step out of the car right no. now. You're under arrest. No, I am not. Yes, you are. No, I am not. Yes, you are. I will tase you if you don't get out of the car. You better take your hands off of me right now. I told you you're under arrest Why? out of the car. Why? Because you have a warrant. I just sent a message and I am... Excuse me. Get out of the car right now. No. Did somebody say that you could come in to our... No, you did this. No, I didn't do anything. Andy asked you to get out. Excuse me? Andy asked you to get out of the car. No, Andy yanked me. I yanked you because I told you you're under arrest and you refused to exit no. your vehicle. Are you going to stand up and be cooperative? Are you going to understand that my attorney has filed a motion to quash this? Has filed a motion going out here? This way. to quash this. You hit us, you do anything stupid towards us, we're any charge done. If you hit us, or anything. Let's go. You've already hit me. I didn't you hit you. Me. I asked you out of the car. I told you you're under arrest. Now you got a whole show for your neighbors here. You are a shitty f***ing human being. You throw somebody down in front of their children? What the f*** is wrong with you? Sit down. I told Don't you. F*** you. F*** you. You piece of sh you know what? You are the piece of dirt that I wouldn't piss on if you were on fire. I smell you an odor of alcohol on your breath. No, that's my That's your I'm on you. Okay. Do you have phone on? Get your f***ing hands off me. Get your f***ing hands off me. Cool. Hey, if you keep resisting, Get your f I'll argue with that. If you, you know what? I'm going to charge you with putting your f***ing dirty ass hands on Stop me. Stop moving. Let him take off your watch. No, he, no. Do you know what he's done? <laughs> you fuck Stop kicking us! I'm gonna kick you right in the f***ing ass! That's mean. Don't that do that. You are dead. What's that? You are getting sued. No, no. What'd you say before that? Face is you said I am dead? What do you mean by that? You are... Elaborate on it if you mean it. You. You're getting sued. Put your, put, put your feet down. No, no, no. Put your no, feet down No, no, no. It, it hurts too much. You could just... You could just take it off. Okay, no. We're not, we're not. No, you're going to kick it. No, what am I? I'm a fucking 100 pounds. You think I'm going to take a 200 pound dude? No, you've already kicked at us a lot of times. Why? You're not going to win. Why? Why? Because that guy right there. The one you this? tried to bite? Okay, Sean, let's go. Why? Could you ask yourself a question? Sean, put your Why? As a result of her escapades, Karen received a litany of charges, including aggravated assault on an officer, aggravated DUI which was actually her third DUI with the child in the vehicle. Then not too long after that, Karen was also charged with endangering the life of a child, violating her bail bond, and then she was also charged with a misdemeanor, resisting and obstructing Can arrest. I just, like, get these handcuffs, like, off me? It's a joke. You just briefly met our next Karen sitting in the back of a squad car. This happened on October 22nd, 2022, after Karen did this with her SUV, but left the scene of the accident. Only problem is, Karen left a key piece of evidence behind, as you're going to see. So you didn't see the crash? You heard it? No, I heard it, and I looked and heard the car against my house. What did she look like, the one driving? Dark hair. Dark hair. Nice looking girl. Nice looking girl. What was she wearing? Black. Oh, my wife said black, black. Oh, black. Take a look at what Karen left behind. Hi there. How are you doing? Not too bad are you guys. Good. The reason I ended up pulling you guys over, um, you guys were coming from that area over there. Did you end up just getting in a crash? No, we live around there, but yeah. What's your name? My name? Yo. Stacy. Time for I've got her over here. It is Stacy. Okay. So Stacy, can I have you come out of the car so I can talk to you? Are you ready to be once? honest with me now? Yeah. Okay. So what happened? What do you mean? What happened with the crash? What crash? You ended up hitting a tree. Do you remember that? No. No? You're not going to be honest with me right now? 
Well, the, I mean, I'm not. Neighbor said said they saw you get picked up. Huh? A neighbor said they saw you get picked up. Okay. Well, I mean, that's fine. So I'm giving you a chance to kind of give me your side of the story of what's going on right now. I mean, there's really no side of the story to give. I, mean, I don't understand what you're wanting me to give to give you. Okay. Well, I want you to be honest with me. That's what I want you to give me. Well, I think there's nothing to be honest about. The truth it. is, like, my car is like probably at my house, and uh, you know, I'm sitting here with my dad. Well, the house that you crashed into, they talked to you and tried to get you to stay there. Well, I didn't crash into anybody's neighbors. Your car is stuck in their house. Well, that's hearsay. Uh, was somebody else driving your car? No, absolutely not. So it was just you driving? Well, I wasn't driving. But no. you just told me absolutely not. Nobody else was driving. No, I was like not I said, driving. I'm not, not going to argue with you about that. My dad was driving. Okay. You, your dad already confirmed that he was not driving the black car. No, he was, so... He, he's driving the vehicle, and so, I mean, what can I do? Okay. I don't want to... R- right now, what you can do is you can give me uh, an answer on whether you would want to do some field testing right No, now. I don't want to, because he was, he's the guy that was driving the, you know... So you're passing your he, options he was... to do the field testing? Yeah. Okay. So at this point, you're going to be under arrest, okay? Why? Because you, you're very intoxicated. Based on what happened, I believe she was into a couple of crashes. Um, she hit a tree in a house. Um, oh my God! Somebody hit the could house itself. Yeah, yeah. Anybody else show up with her when she got there? No. Did she say she was with somebody? No. She babbled some lies, and then you know, and I couldn't make sense of anything. Sure. She was probably so worked up. And can you please inform me of what I'm being charged with? Yep, I, I told you it's uh, going to be an OWI. It'll be fourth. A fourth OWI. But I wasn't driving. Did you hear what the officer just said to Karen? This is her fourth OWI, operating while intoxicated. In addition, she was hit with a hit and run charge. Stop right now! In this one, neighbors called the police because a male Karen and a female Karen were physically fighting on their street. When the police arrived, they saw the female Karen walking away, but as soon as she spotted the police officer, she did something that wasn't very smart. Miss, stop! Stand there. Okay, I won't. Stand there. Stand there. Stand there. Stop right now! Put your other hand behind your back. Hey! Step it! Ben! Ben, step it! Ben! 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 Do not pull away from me! Do you understand? You are under arrest. You are going to comply. You are not going to pull away from me. If you quit resisting, then you throw that up. Yeah, you deal with Yeah, you feel on a daily basis. What is your name, miss? I don't have a f-ing name. Okay. Well, you do. No, I don't. Stop trying to pull away from me. My okay? hair's in my goddamn mouth. Relax. Hold still, please. No, you're not even supposed to be doing this. Then stop fighting You're me. a man. You cannot Shit. touch me. Tough shit. You cannot touch me. That's all no, we got. No, you need to get her over here. You cannot touch me. Just stop it. Stop it. Stop it. You cannot touch me! Jenna! Don't you kick me or you're gonna go to the ground again! Get over here! You just added another charge by kicking me, by the way. I was sitting in front of my window and they came out the stop sign. Basically, she was all over him. He didn't really do anything. But she kept grabbing him, ripped his shirt open. 
kept jumping on top of them, trying to get them to the ground. They finally did get to the ground, <clears throat> but then came back up and wouldn't let them leave or anything else. Well, at first, I'm like, are they just screwing around? Yeah. Because she was all over them. Yeah. Okay. You said, you, she said she was, like, jumping on its back or yeah. something? Okay. And then she kept well, grabbing at his throat. In, Charles, Adam, and, like, Mary, I'm calling the soon. North. Well, after talking to this neighborhood watch guy with the walkie-talkie, the police arrested Karen, and she was charged with felony battery on a police officer, misdemeanor, resisting arrest, and disorderly conduct. And then they also found drug paraphernalia on her, which they charged her with and also explains a lot. But Karen must have had a guardian angel because almost all of the charges were dropped. The only charges that were kept in place were the misdemeanor resisting arrest and the misdemeanor disorderly conduct. Everything else was wiped out. Miss, just stay in the car. I just want to witness it. Okay, no, you have to stay in the car. No, I want to witness it. You I'm so in the car. sorry, but I'm Miss, hearing what you're saying, you and I need to, to witness the. Okay, do you do you realize that by interfering with motor vehicle stop and if you want to arrest me? Rush- Miss. No, I know. You I don't want to Miss. 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 Back on May 21st, 2023. A New Jersey police officer noticed a car that was swerving and following another vehicle too closely. So he decided to pull the vehicle over and this is what happened. Hey, how are you? Just have a driver's license registration proof insurance with you. I'm sorry? Both of us? Yeah, if you got yours, sure. I'm sorry? Thank you. I'm sorry. Like, I don't get pulled over. I don't know where my... Insurance, registration, and license. I gave you my license. I have your passenger's license, I believe. I have yours. What do you have a ticket for there? You're holding a ticket in your hand. Is that yours? Yeah, I hate this ticket. I just haven't cleaned my car. Don't judge me. Okay. (laughs) Where are you guys coming from today? Donovan's. Donovan's? Yeah. Alright. How much does you have to drink today? You're the passenger in the vehicle, so I'm not too concerned. I'm concerned with... Yeah. Have you had anything to drink today? Any yeah. illegal drugs? Any... No. Just alcohol? Yes, I had two drinks. Two yeah. drinks? Okay. How's your license? What? How's your license? Are you suspended? Anything like that? Oh, no. No? All right. Do me a favor. Turn the key off and just throw the keys up on the dashboard for me, all right? I'm going to go double check your license, and I'll be right back with you. All right, Karina, step out of the car for me. Why? Because I want to talk to you on the side of the road. And probably you know get. A- what? I can drive home. What do you mean? I'm not. I didn't drink anything. All right, that's fine. But I can take a so the re- test. I can, I can do anything you want. I I just have. I only. The only issue I have is the reason why I'm stopping you guys in the first place is okay. when you were coming over the bridge. I noticed that. You guys were failing to maintain your lane. Okay, um, so I saw you guys laughing and joking. So, but yeah, as I continue were, to were. follow you guys it's down the hot, okay. no. no. listen, listen. We'll, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. The other issue, I'm, the I'm, other I'm, issue is, you, you handed me a driver's license that says you are not 21 I'm until 20, next year. I'm 24 years old. So talk. no, you're the driver did. No, I'm 24. Years old. So right now I'm asking you to step out of the vehicle so we can talk on the side of the road. Step out of the vehicle. Yes. I believe you're intoxicated. Listen, I mean... Well, I mean, it's fine. It's just get out of here. Alright. All we're going to do is we're going to step on the side of the road. We're going to have a chat. 
and we're gonna go from there. All right. How long ago did you guys leave Donovan's? Thirty minutes ago. Thirty minutes ago. How much did you really have to drink? The fish are on. They really got it. Really got it. Alright. They got me. So, like I said, I stopped you because the whole way down the highway, you're not maintaining your lane. Ma'am, stay in the car. Ma'am, stay in the car. Stay in the car. Stay in. Miss, get in the car. I'm sorry, guys. I'm new to this. I'm like way too. That's alright. Um. Do you have ID? Yes, of course. I'm yeah, I'm on medication right, right now. I, I just need to see your ID. I just I that's why I didn't drive. Hold on, Danny. I'm trying to find the relax. I just need right, Can you hang up the phone? Yeah. I, actually it's my boyfriend. I'm gonna put him on speaker if you don't uh, mind. No, you can hang him up the phone. I'm gonna put it on speaker, thank you. Danny. Right. I can't find my I know it should be. I have my debit card, I have my credit card, I have my credit karma card. I just had my ID. I, I, I literally, I... Is this vehicle in your name, ma'am? No, this is not my car, it's not my vehicle. I am, I'm on medication, which is why I didn't drive, I'm with sober. Okay. You're not in any trouble. I know. I can drive. You're not. Okay. I, ju I have. You're. You're. Where is my ID? Okay. Ma'am, you're not in any trouble. No, right? I don't care if I'm in trouble. Okay. I just, I just want you to know I have my ID. Pain. You're not in any trouble. I just need I'm to see. You. My yeah, just when you get a chance. Baby, That's do it. You, um, do you remember the last time I had my license? Yeah, that's fine. Okay, just sit over here. Here? Yep, right there. Perfect. Do you have a shirt that you want to put on? Oh god. I guess we do have a shirt. Not cold. Of course. Perfect. Thank you. Yeah, that's why you're not cold. For thinking. Alright, just stand right here. You see where this pink is? This pink letters or orange letters? Just stand right there. And do what? I'm sorry. Alright. Why don't you, why don't you yeah, put the put the sweatshirt on? I'm like, god damn, I gotta put myself together. I'm like, outside, sweatshirt. Okay. Alright. Do you have any issues with your legs? Do you have any medical conditions that affect your balance? Any injuries? Any back injuries? God, I hope not. So yes, have you been injured? I don't know. I've been taking medication to keep the blood wrong. Okay. I mean, like, blood work and stuff. But I don't think Miss, what's your name? Karina. Car Karina? Karina. Karina? Yeah. Okay. Wait. I want you I Wait. want you to pay attention very closely to what he's telling you to do. Okay? And I want you I want you to do only that. So I want you I want you to look, okay? So this is what he said, right? So you're gonna stand here with your feet together like this, toes pointed forward. You see where my you see how my hands are? You see how they're down by my side? I want you to keep your hands at your side. Touching, touching the sides of your legs. All right. Then you're going to extend your foot. You're going to extend your foot straight out in front of you, keeping your foot parallel to the ground. Okay. That's okay. So I want you just, I just want you to watch what I'm doing. Okay. I don't want you to do it yet. All right. You're going to stand with your foot parallel to the ground. Ma'am, just stay in the car. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm looking for my license. That's okay. That's okay. It's, it's fine. All right. Ma'am, just stay in your car. Okay. Just, just stay in the car. Okay. All right. It's okay. So just, Whatever. we're just going to get back to this. Okay. So, all right. So this is what I, this is what I, yep. Yeah, I don't want you to do it yet. I don't want you to do it yet. Okay. I don't, don't start yet. So just put your foot down at your side. Okay. You're going to stand like this. You're going to have your hands down at your side like this. You're going to extend your leg in front of you. Don't do it yet. Just listen to me. All right. You're going to send your leg in front of you. You're going to keep your foot parallel to the ground. You're going to keep your eye on your foot as you're doing this 
you're going to count out loud by 1,000s. So 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, so on and so forth until I tell you to stop. That's awful. If, wait, 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 it's not yet, Sorry. not yet. All right, so if at any time you drop your foot, so if, let's say, 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, if you drop your foot, you're going to pick it back up and start from where you left off. So, for example, 1, 1,000, wait, 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 listen to me. So, 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000, 3, 1,000, drop it, pick it back up, 4, 1,000, 5, 1,000, 6, 1,000, and you're going to keep going until we tell you to stop. Oh, okay. All right. One so, thousand, uh, two, one thousand. so that's you, right wait, though. Yep. I gotta make sure I pass the test. No, like, that's okay. Do you have any? Do you have any other questions though? One, one thousand, two, one thousand, like that, right? Yep, like that. But you're gonna keep your arms down at your side, touching your side. Extend it out in front of you, foot parallel to the ground. I'm sorry. I'm so, let's start from the beginning. All right. So I want you to start from the starting position. Ma'am, I need you to come to the back of the car. Okay. Ma'am, I need you to stay in the car. I show you. We are, we are on a highway. Wait, wait, no, I need you to stay in the car. We're on a highway, okay? Miss, come on. Oh my God. Okay. I'm sorry. So from here, I'm sorry. All right, do you have any questions about that test? All right, remember, arms at your side, down your side, foot extended in front of you, foot parallel to the ground when I tell you to begin. Okay. All right. I'm ready. Okay, you may begin. Miss, I need you to stay in the no, car. No, I am. There is somebody coming okay. for me. All right, just. I, I am gonna stay in the car. Okay, just stay in the car. Okay, that's fine. I'm sorry. That's fine. I just stay in the car. Leave, can I hit, hold my hand out the window? Is that okay? Yeah, let's just close the car door. Just okay, fine. you can stay with the window open. Your side, Miss, just stay in the car. I just want to witness it. Okay, no, you have to stay in the car. No, I want to witness it. You I'm so in the car. sorry, but I'm Miss, hearing what you're saying, you and I need to, to witness the. Okay, do you do you realize that by interfering with motor vehicle stop and if we're you doing that, we could also arrest you for obstruction. So please okay, get back in the car. Okay, do you want to arrest me? I really don't. I, I want don't want you to, get you to either. I just want to see so what's going on. So then I need on. you to get into the Listen, vehicle. I'm in pain. I can't okay. sit. Can I stand? Can I stand here? I need you to get into the vehicle. I need you to get into. There's somebody five Miss, minutes away. I need you to get into Can the vehicle. I stand up Miss, I need you to get into the vehicle and stay in the vehicle. Here? Can I stand? Miss, I need you to get into the vehicle and stay in the vehicle. I'm begging Miss, you. I need you I'm to get in. You for Miss, I stand. need you to get into the vehicle and stay in the vehicle. We are I, on a highway. I understand. Okay, I need you Listen, to please get into the vehicle. I'm not. I'm not trying to. Miss, you. I'm not. Miss, I'm not. Listen, gonna, what's your name? I'm not going to tell you again. Please get into the vehicle. Okay. Miss, I respect you. I respect you. Please get into the vehicle. Please get into the vehicle. Stay into the vehicle. Do not leave the vehicle until we tell you to leave the vehicle. Do you understand that? Okay. I have to finish what she's doing and then I will come back and talk to you. I promise. I'm sorry. All right. Do you have any questions about what we talked about? One more thousand like that, you said, right? I'm going to explain and demonstrate this test one more time. No, 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 no. No, I'm not. I'm not that stupid. I don't. Okay. All right. What's your name? What's your name? Olivia Morrow. Okay, I need my boyfriend right. is right here. Okay. I'm I need you, you to take some deep breaths. It's okay. Not about you. you need to stay in the vehicle. We are on a very busy highway. I understand. Even when your boyfriend gets here, you cannot leave this vehicle no, until I, I tell you I you can leave this vehicle. I'm very Do you understand? Sorry. I'm very sorry. Okay, please stay in the vehicle. Please stay in the vehicle. During each step, I want you to touch feel the toe. Miss. I know, I know. You I'm trying to arrest me. Miss. Miss. This is my mom's car. Okay, I'm Miss. Here. But listen. I don't care. L no, Miss. I'm in pain. I miss. need to stand up. Miss. Okay. I'm in pain. Miss. I understand. I'm not trying okay. to disrespect you. Listen. Turn it off. Miss. I'm in, I'm in a lot of pain. You need to calm down. You cannot just run out of a vehicle on a motor listen. vehicle stop until we allow you I to go. Understand.
Yes. I will stand wherever yes. you want me to. Listen. But I need to stand up. Listen. I cannot sit. I cannot yes. sit. If you're not listening, I'm a nurse. I need to stand. So tell me where to stand. I will stand wherever you want me to. But I cannot sit in that car. I will stand there. I will stand there. I will stand anywhere. Please let me stand. Okay. Anywhere. You need to understand. I understand. Okay. Everything when you you're saying. No, you have not because you have not listened to a thing I have said. I will listen so to you. So if we go back to the car, once okay. you're free to leave, I will allow you to leave with your boyfriend, okay? But you I cannot know. just run out of a vehicle okay. when you're on a motor vehicle I stop. Put, I'm, not I'm sorry, to but can I please, okay. can you let me stand? You, okay. Please. please. You need to listen to me. I will listen to you, but can you please okay. let me stand up? That's all I'm asking. I don't need to. I will sit. I will stand by the car. I just need to stand. Right. I need you to stop talking. Okay. Okay. I'm going to let you take her because I'm afraid that she's going to next run and cross the highway. I'm not she won't and cross I just, the highway. Okay. I understand. I, but that's why I'm nervous because she has not listened to anything that no, we have no, said I this entire that. time and she's been very belligerent. I just okay. I want her to be safe. I want her to get out of here. I, just I think she does still have belongings in that car. I cannot let you take those until we're done with what My we're purse, doing. So if you want to hang out right here. Okay, that's fine. All right. Listen. But she can't. She's not going to be. If she gets into this vehicle. she wants doctor's notes, I will give it to her. You either need to get into the Walk us back into that vehicle. So let me get you my belongings. To, you need to get into this vehicle, or you need to get into that vehicle. But those are your two options. You cannot stand outside the car. Am I being okay. arrested? Am I being arrested? If you keep interfering, I can arrest you. I don't okay, so want to do that. I, so please get into the vehicle. Can I not get my belongings? Get into the vehicle, and we will get your belongings I'm for you. you a I cannot have you running back and forth across this highway. I'm not going to stay right here. I'm going to I'm going to arrest you. You don't get into this car. Okay. Get in the car. Listen to your boyfriend and get into the car. I'm gonna get it. We're gonna get it. Just sit down and relax. Lock the doors, please keep them in there. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You guys are in the something got tied, dropping stuff off the road. Yeah, we did. We're having a jump break. Clear that out. Lower court. Do you have anything in your car that you're going to need? Cell phone, wallet? Alright, we'll grab some stuff for you. Mm -hmm. I'm not okay with it. At all. Okay. Do you have a cell phone in here that you need? So what exactly are you guys doing? Like, You're being placed under arrest for driving while intoxicated. Okay. Do you have a cell phone in here or anything that you need? Mm-hmm. Okay, we'll where grab it for you. I don't, I do not know, so. Okay, alright, I'll, I'll look for it and I'll, right. I'll grab it. I'll get it for you, okay? Do you have well, a wallet in here? Yeah. What color, which color is yours? The brown one or the black one? The black. The black one. Oh yours? my god. Alright. I cannot believe that. Alright, let's go back here. I'm pretty sure these are her shoes since they were on her side, and I'm I think so this sorry. is her purse. Is there any way okay. What police station? So Highlands. Okay. Uh, is she gonna be on holding cell? Yeah, she's she's under arrest. Okay, we're gonna go there. Okay, she's not gonna be I out for a long time, for a while. Me? Yes, it's, not, it's gonna be a while. It's gonna be a couple know, hours, but she's out. Hours. All right. Um, so I would bring her home. <laughs> not drunk. I would bring her home. Hey, what's going on? Hi, yeah, I'm here for Karina Ronda. Okay, can you give us like five minutes and then um, I'll bring no, her home? No, can I come inside? No. I just need to make sure she's okay. She's fine. Because right. her mom's in not, about five, so we're going to have to wait. In about five minutes, I'm going to bring a form out. Okay, I'll wait here, wait five minutes. Okay.
Great. You're going to have to wait. You have your license with you? Yeah, I have it. Thank you. Yes, sir. So I'm just going to grab one form. I'm going to have you read through it real quick. Yes, sir. Um, in summary, what the form says is you're not going to let Karina drive for a minimum of 12 hours. Okay. All right. That's not a problem. And then after you... Uh, and then where can we pick up their car? Or is that being... We'll go over that in a second. Okay. After being processed, Karina was released to Karen's boyfriend on the signature bond because she had been charged with operating a vehicle under the influence, refusal to submit to a chemical test, reckless driving, failure to maintain marked lanes, and following too closely. While Karina was wrong for drinking underage and wrong for getting behind the wheel of a vehicle, I wish that her friend would have recognized that she had been drinking and offered to drive since her friend hadn't been drinking. Because I'm not operating the vehicle, I'm not driving the vehicle, and we're all good. No, you are operating the vehicle, man. No, I'm not. You drove into a house. No, I didn't. I think that um, that popped off right about there. You see the skid marks? Yeah, right there. And so when that popped off, she wasn't able to go any further. Yeah. There is a house that got hit by something heavy, a white car, a well, white I was SUV. Not in a white car that hit You're a not house in a white SUV? I wasn't. Okay, about come, on the car. No. come on out. Come on out. No, no. Ma'am, come out of the. I said step sure out. Is. I said step out. Back on April 5th of 2023, the police responded to reports of a drunk driver driving a white SUV which had heavy damage on the front. When the police showed up, they looked at Karen's vehicle and saw that it had a large piece of wood sticking out of its grill. But being an entitled Karen, the woman refused to accept reality, so the police had to take matters into their own hands. Hi there. Hi, how are you? Doing all right. Looks yeah. like you're having a little car trouble. I am. So what happened? I don't know. You don't know what happened? No, I had a little accident, but we're figuring it out. We're going to... Who are you talking to? Triple A. I live in the neighborhood. I'm good. We're all good here. No, it's not good. No, it's good because I'm not operating the vehicle. I'm not driving the vehicle, and we're all good. No, you are operating the vehicle, man. No, I'm not. You drove into a house. No, I didn't. You did, actually. You did. Um, so... Excuse me, I'll call you back. Yeah, well, you're on Google, so it's... Um, so, you were in possession of the vehicle. You were driving the vehicle. You drove into somebody's house. Which house? One down here on uh, Newtown Road. So, how much have you had to drink tonight? On Newtown Road? Which right. house on Newtown Road? Uh, you, was there another one you hit? No, there was no house I hit on Newtown Road. I'm confused. So, yeah, you seem a little confused. So, no, you've suffered a whole you. bunch of damage. Um, so, let's talk about the house on Newtown Road. Right. So, you... That's what I said. You know what I think? I think that um, that popped off. Right about there, you see the skid marks? Yeah, right there. And so when that popped off, she wasn't able to go any further. Yeah. She's like, well, it's kind of muddy. We'll walk her and pull her low. <laughs> she was on the phone with AAA, and she's like, I'll call you back, I guess. We'll be there about 8 a.m. to get you. <laughs> right? That's, I love it when they say, uh, don't, don't touch I'll, any of that. Yeah, she's got a number on her. There's more parts in the trunk. That's parts of the front step. Mm. I can't believe she made it this far. I can't believe she went, didn't go straight through the freaking house. Well, that dude. too. 
Okay, ma'am. I'm going to go ahead and have you Talk step out. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and step out of the car. No, I'm not going to step out of the car. Ma'am, you need to step out of the vehicle. So okay. on Newtown Road? Regardless, let's get past that right now. You've hit a, a number of things. Okay, you went off the road. You hit a guardrail. You've got parts of the guardrail stuck in your grill. Okay. I want to talk about the house. All right, get out of the about. car. No, I'm not going to get out of the car. Ma'am, you need to step out of the car. Okay. No, I'm going to just talk Peeler. about... So, Ms. Peeler, why don't you go ahead and get out of the vehicle, okay? I just want to talk about the house that you're talking about. Okay. So you're saying you did not hit that car. house? I just want to talk Just the guardrail. The okay, talk about it. Go ahead. No, I want to hear what you say about the house that I hit. There is a house that got hit by something heavy, a white car. A white well, I was SUV. not in a white car that hit You're a house. You're not in a white SUV? I wasn't near a house that hit a car. Okay. So, yeah, the house didn't hit the car. A car hit the house. Um, so, you did drive into a guardrail. Okay. You've got but the parts of the we're guardrail. We're talking about a house. No, ma'am. Listen That's to me. That's a whole different you know, thing. All right. Forget about the house. Forget about the house. Okay. Yeah, Let's say you had nothing to do with the house. Okay. We're no, moving on. I'm not going to. But what I'm telling you is you drove into a guardrail. Right? So I'm there's not, parts of the guardrail. You were talking about a house. That's a whole different thing. No, I said we thing. were out here searching. Okay. That's what I said. We'll move on past that. Okay. Cool. No, I don't want to talk about coal and talking about passing. I want to talk about you said that I right, hit a house. You need to get out. No. You need to I get out. No. No, I don't need to get out. You wrecked your car. You left the scene of an accident. No. You drove into a guardrail. Right. Yes, you, there's pieces of the guardrail. Okay, but I want you to talk about the house no. because no, you want to talk about it now. No, I you want to stop to... now. Okay, we are one step from me dragging you out of this car. Do you, you understand me? You do not need to get. No, you need to stop and listen. No, because you need to stop and no, listen. You need to stop and listen because I don't want I am... to be bullied. I'm and not trying I don't to bully you. you. I'm trying to talk to you. I know. And, but you keep but backtracking. No. What I'm saying you is you, you wrecked understand. your car. You left the scene of an accident. Okay? But I want... Okay. You wrecked I your understand. car. I okay. Yes. So, but I want to understand what we're talking about leaving the scene of an accident. Right. I'm, now I'm not, talking about the guardrail. What, okay. No. I'm you said talking you about the house. The I house. Have a, did the house have paint on it? I don't know. I didn't go down. I, I didn't go to that the house. house. Do you want me to check? Yeah. Yeah. Check. Yeah, because so, I'm not going okay. to be bullied. I just, and, well, I, did you, listen. Right, ma'am, I'm, I'm Officer Warman. I know. I, know, you, you I, know, I, I haven't introduced know. myself. I haven't introduced myself. I'm introducing myself. Right that's fine. That's fine. That's yes, great. I will pull that on. Like, and I don't please want to do, do I've got mine on. He's got his on. I know. But and you're, I want, you, but I don't you are want, not listening. No. Okay. You are not listening. Because I want what to What I'm telling you is I'm about to pull you out of your car if you do not step out of this car. No, I'm not doing anything wrong. You crashed your vehicle. You fled the scene of an accident. The third was a white SUV. Okay. But I want to understand what So you crashed your vehicle. And you fled the scene of an accident. No, I didn't flee. If you leave the scene of an accident, then that is fleeing. That's why I'm, I'm explaining but it to you. I want to understand what you think that I did with that. There's pieces of the guardrail in your okay. grill. But that doesn't matter. What it does, does that matter. mean when... That is, that is not your property, right? The guardrail is not your property. Yeah. You crashed but your car into it. I want to understand it. what we're talking about. That's when what I keep you telling say you. say what I okay. did. Ma'am, step out. Step out of the car. No, I'm not going to okay. step out come of the car. Out. Come on out. No, no. Ma'am, come out of the I said step out. I said step out. Step out of the car. You are under arrest. No, I don't think we need to do this. I got it. I got it. Well, you I think wrong. I got it. I'm going to put on my shoes. It's okay. Which I, I st asked you several times. Okay. You refuse okay. to comply. It's okay. Okay. No. It's okay. It didn't have to go no. that way, did it? It's a, Let's really, go. We go don't have we're to going back to. This. Come on. You are under arrest. Please, I don't need to be manhandled. Ma'am, I asked you about 15 times to step out of that car. I didn't. You were given a law. It doesn't matter. You were given a lawful order to step out I of the vehicle. Wasn't you refused doing to do anything. it. Good. Have a seat. You're driving while impaired is what you're doing. No, I but wasn't step driving. Down. Sit down. Sit down. I wasn't driving when you... Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. You're in control of the vehicle. Has to be right now. And my partner is being very, very nice. I'm going to let them... Please. Ma'am. Come on. Right now you're detained. Okay. Can you please uncuff no, me? No, you this are going to remain ridiculous. cuffed. ridiculous. 
Yeah, Why? Absolutely is ridiculous. I haven't done anything. Move your leg. Ma'am. Okay. Move your leg. Ma'am. Okay. You're being completely <gasps> oh my god. No. Dude, if I shut it so quick, she's gonna spring back out of there. <laughs> Ma'am, we're not going to open the door because you've showed us that you can't just keep your legs in the car. No, it's okay. Not. I just don't want my arms. I'm not a menace to society, so. honestly. Okay. Well, there's another officer on the way to talk to you, okay? Right now, right now, I, I'm arresting you for resisting. I'm not resisting. What, that was what that was. You refusing to get out of the car okay, is resisting you arrest. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Is yeah. Because, um, I don't know what's going yeah. on. I, I kind of ended up doubling back before this was called out. Well, I was trying to explain it to you, but you refused to listen. So I'm not going to have listen. I'm not going to have any more conversation about it as of right now. So, okay, trying to be and doing it are two different things, but like I said, we're not going to have any more conversation right now, all right? I just, I don't want you hurting your leg, you need to not be banging on the doors and stuff, okay? They do not need an ambulance, just stating that they do not want to fly. Well, right now, right now you're under arrest, so you need to just hang out and wait. Can we just uncuff these pieces? No. Yeah. No, you're going to remain handcuffed. So where'd you come from prior to the county? I understand. Okay. No. So my suggestion is sit there and zip it. Hey. Well, I'm telling you, okay, because it's going to get really out of hand, really quick, and you're going to wind up catching another charge with me. No, no, no. Anytime anybody goes in the back of one of our cars, they get cuffed. That is our department policy, okay? But I don't think that there was anything that you saw that I did illegally. There's nothing that you saw. No. Well, let's start off with physical control. Yeah. No, for for, for starters. My car was stopped. You didn't uh, see me driving. On the road the roadway. Control. Yeah. And you were behind yeah, the wheel. No it's called physical stopped. control. Not, not yeah. Not behind the wheel. It was stopped. Oh, you, you weren't wheel. behind the wheel, so I you didn't try to grab the, the steering road. wheel, and we didn't have to drag you out. No, right? Okay. Will you stick to your story? I'll stick to mine. And we'll go from there. Okay? You'll have your day in court. Yeah, hopefully she doesn't try that. Enough's enough. Yeah. I mean, I mean, so I mean, just imagine. Could you imagine if kids were outside? Dang, oh man. She hit that house. And she don't think she did anything wrong. She got part of the she house. Won't in, it. She won't own it. Did you see part of the house in the grill? I didn't, I didn't get down there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's in the front of the car. Yeah. Do I just want to know why I'm here and I would like to use the restroom. Would you bring her to her? Yes. She said yes or no? Yeah. Okay, we can take her take her over there and have her sign. Take it over there, have her sign, put her name, sign it, put the time. I don't have to sign anything. You don't want to sign? No. Okay, okay. that's fine. Put her shoes. Just put her shoes. Put her shoes. I want to use the restroom. Okay. Why I'm here. Because you were on arrest for OBI. For what? OBI. Operating a vehicle while under the intoxication. No, I was, you did not pull me over. I was no, not. you crashed your vehicle. You crashed into a house. I was okay. not operating that vehicle when you pulled me over. So that's you, not you crashed into a house and you left the scene. Okay? May I use the restroom, please? Now, right this minute, you're going to wait. Okay. Okay, so when in this whole situation were you... Convicting me of this. You never breathalyzed me. You never pulled me over. I don't know why you're. Okay. I don't understand that. There's no proof. So, sir, I just have a question. Yes, ma'am. Where's the car? I do not know right now. I, I believe it's. Last, last time I heard it was still where, where you left it. What you were But they are. Yes, and it's going to be towed. Okay. But our trip, I don't know where we're at right at this moment. We'll find it out. Yeah, yeah, we will give you a slip on how to get that back. I'm not sure if it was being taken to headquarters 
because you crashed into a building or if it's being taken to can a you, tow lot. Can you give me the address of the building that has physically crashed into? Is it will be in, it will be in the report and your attorney can get that for you. Thank you. When they say by forcing more like did she like you? Like physically As far as what? What's, what are we doing? When can I leave? I'm actually about to take you up to Anderson Mercy right now to be checked out. Checked out? What do you mean? Um, checked out by medical staff at Anderson Mercy. No, I'm not going to refuse that. Okay, Why would I? Because you're, up, you're being arrested. You're being transported to the justice center. Under what ruling is that? For the OVI, for resisting arrest. I didn't resist trust. you. I was just confused. I still don't understand that charge, honestly. That's why I've explained it to you. Like, when I explained it to you before, you usually get out of the vehicle. After being told multiple times to do so, you were told you were under arrest, Still refuse. Just because you say no, I don't want to be arrested, doesn't mean you're not being arrested. Well, it's confusing if you can understand that. So I, I can't. Understand. I absolutely okay. cannot understand that. I don't. You, you I, were told you're under arrest. You so still why were you in Mercy Anderson? I don't understand that. Because you're involved in a car wreck. Our jail won't accept you. I was not involved. I was. A, it was not a car wreck with someone else. Mm -hmm. No, it was a wreck into a guardrail in a house. A guardrail, not with a person. So I'm no, it was a house. A house is a big structure to hit. So they have to check you at the hospital and clear you. Oh, you know. And if you, yeah, when you tell them that, it's fine. Great, we'll be in and out. Um, so we're going to go that route. So what if Transport I refuse to, to go to Mercy? Yes, I got a call. So you can't refuse. You can't refuse. You can't refuse. Why? You can't. You're under arrest. Just, you cannot refuse. I'm just asking. I'm not trying to be. And that's just giving you your answer. You cannot refuse. Okay. Yes, yeah. yeah. May I call my daughter or something? I mean, no. Yes, that works. Nope. Here we go. How old is your daughter? I'm not going to answer that. No, that's fine, but it's still our policy to handcuff someone that's under arrest. As of the date of this upload, this case is actually still being investigated. But as things currently stand, Karen has been charged with obstructing official police business and resisting arrest. No! Let me talk to your supervisor! Back on January 3rd of 2023, police were called out to a bar because there was a Karen causing a disturbance. Apparently, Karen was in the men's bathroom standing on the counter yelling at a group of men. The bar's security was able to come in, get Karen off the counter and out of the bar, and the police are called and that's where we pick up. No way, no way. No way, are you kidding me? No way, no way, no way, no way, no way. Are you kidding me? You came literally at the worst second, those men were literally attacking me for the whole night. No, no, no. No way, sir. Like, I'm telling you, those men were literally attacking me for the whole night. And at the second they came, I was literally dividing myself. No, please don't arrest me. Like, I'm telling you, this. That was literally the one second I was defending myself. I'm telling you right now, like, I'm telling you. That was the one second I was literally defending myself, and these men were literally attacking me all night. That's, I'm, I'm so upset now. It's okay. It's okay. I'm just so upset now. As a woman, I'm the only one. Okay. As a woman, I'm the only one. Cops and all the men who were literally 
standing up and going like this to me and they're all they're all pretty tall. It's okay. <sighs> Downstairs, she started doing the most inside. So I'm trying to bring her to the elevator to let her go. She turned around, kicked me in the leg, just doing all the extra. Okay. To the point where I just put her down, held her hands around her back, told the manager to call you. Uh, I I only saw her I for the last half hour. I okay. got here at like nine. And I said I'd see her here. Okay, so she's been here for a few hours. Yeah. Um, upstairs or downstairs, she's yelling at people. Yeah, upstairs, she's running around. She said she lost her purse. I tried to help her find it. She left. She came back. I had a woman come in and get me and said there was a girl in the bathroom freaking out. She was sitting up on the counter screaming and looking herself in the mirror screaming. Um, she came out. I tried to walk her outside. She started flailing her hands and kicking and screaming. So I wrapped my hands around her and I walked her outside. I tried to tell her she could leave and put her in the elevator. And when she turned around the elevator, she started kicking and screaming and flailing. So I just placed her down and put her hands behind her back. Okay. Um, you got any security camera footage of any of this? Uh, you could get, we could probably get uh, me wrapping her up and then walking her. I have my hands on her arms and walk okay. her down. And that's, I don't know what our cameras are going to get down by the elevator. You might see some of it. Okay. Is that something you could get or is that like a corporate tomorrow thing? No, I can get it. Okay. Can you work on that for yeah. me? And we'll take care of this. Thanks. Charge.
evidence. They took me without any reconciliation. They literally just took me off the street and put me in the back of their car. If you want this to be you, just say nothing and live your life. But if you want reform against police, please say something. This is not right. They can't do whatever the they want, whenever the they want. This is wrong. They cuffed me up. For what reason? What did I do? I got on a bad day. No. This is not right. Are you kidding me? This is so wrong. And you know what? They're gonna get you know what? You know what? I have a good ass lawyer. And you, uh, you know, I want to prove a point. Because I'm, I'm what I said, ask lawyer friends. So I want to prove a point to see what happens when I run away from the cops. But they're getting illegally, illegally detained. Thank you legally detain me. <laughs> Rob, what was she doing when you got here? Security was on top of her? Yeah, she was laying on the ground, like struggling, and the guy was on top top of her and he was like out of breath. Okay. She flailing, kicking, screaming? Yeah. If you break anything in my car, no, it's if you okay, break anything in my car, can you give me you're going to be charged so my with criminal mischief, no, felony. No, I'm not. So you better stop it. breaking can stuff you in my car. Can you give me your phone so I can call my lawyer? No. Right now. No, that's illegal. <laughs> give me my phone. Well, I got to go pull a video of you being doing shenanigans. I wasn't doing anything. Only I'm telling you these men were me over. Ma'am. I'm telling you these men were me over. I'm telling you I wasn't doing anything at all. I got to go do my job. Sir, you didn't want to talk. If to you us. were doing your job, no, sir. Oh God, yo, oh. Okay, so anybody who's watching this tape, please, please, anyone who is watching this tape right now, please remember what the he said to me when I said, "Hey, I wasn't doing anything wrong." Please just let me call my friends. And he said, no, sit the f back and let me get you in trouble, basically. So, he basically said, sit the f back. Actually, real dog. He said, sit the f back and you're going to get arrested right now. That's actually what he really said. So, honestly, if anyone should be in trouble right now, it shouldn't be me. Like... I really did nothing wrong. Please let me out. What? Hey, wait! Hey! Come back! No! No! Come back! No! Let me talk to your supervisor! Let me talk to your supervisor! Let me talk to your supervisor! Are you kidding me? Let me talk to your Supervisor, are you kidding me, you piece of shit? Nah. Okay, bring me to court already. Nah, this is not fair. Hey, where's your superior? I want your superior officer. 
I want superior officer right now. Superior officer. Get superior officer. You're going to lose your job. You're going to lose your job. You yo superior officer. Are you gonna let me do something? I uh, have no, to. I'll let I have you to do put. Whatever you want, look, you're cool and nice to me. I am. Yeah, I have to put my. I, love you. I have to put my handcuffs on you. That's why I have to make sure. I already sure. have some on. I, I, I gotta give him back to that sergeant so that he can yeah, go back to work. Okay. The sergeant. Yeah. He, Wait, no, Mr. Sergeant. No, cause no, sergeant, sir, sergeant. I gotta I give him back his cuffs. Here right now, but I can't like, do that oh, if you're. Lawyer. Listen, ma'am. Nicole. No, you want him to stay here while I come my lawyer? No, I want him to go back to work. Okay. So. So who's gonna be the boss man? When I am. I'm, uh, I'm. I'm here. So are, okay. you, are you also a sergeant? I am not a sergeant. Okay. So who's gonna? Hey, be put those things back, back behind you. Hey, Nicole, uh, put the cuffs behind your back. Okay. That's a charge if you. Oh, sorry. Yes, I, I, I was trying to feed you the answer, not to I'm put them in the front. I'm, I don't want you to get a charge for having cuffs in front of you. You're good. Just relax. All right, I'm going to open this door. I'm going to put my handcuffs on you. They have to be in your back, though, okay? Uh, wait, they're not there. Put them in your back, wait. please. Okay, I've been nice to you. Be nice to me, okay? Yeah, Are you going to be nice? Yeah. I put your feet be. down, though. I don't want to... I promise I will, but my feet... Yeah. You promise? You promise you won't get mad at me? Miss Nicole, sit up so I can help. All right. She was listening to I'm red, so... Okay. Um, we're gonna put my handcuffs on her. She's a little squirrely, so... Okay. Hopefully I calmed her down. I'll talk to her real quick before we open it. I'm right here. Nicole? Hey. I'm gonna make it more it's comfortable. Okay. Can you sit this up? Is, this is literally all I can do right now. I can't move my arms and legs. Okay. I want to How about you put them back in the front? Can you do that again? And then we'll we'll go from there. Whatever you do, okay, please. As long as you don't get just don't now sit up like a normal person in a chair. Feet on the ground. Perfect. Don't make nope. put your toes on the ground. Now just stay there, okay? Relax, relax. Relax. Just do me a favor. Don't. don't Honestly, go crazy. I'm telling you right now. The reason I even I'm out here right now. I'll make these feel better, okay? Please do, because they're really tight. Okay. And my lawyer's going to be so mad. Can I please talk to your superior officer? Please don't spit my face. Just look that way while I do this. No, can I talk to your superior officer right now? When I get these cuffs fixed. Right now. Where's the boss man? Put this hand Call him. Call him right now. Keep your hand down there. Right there. Okay? Okay. Just relax for me. Please call the superior officer. Relax for me. Relax. But keep your hand down. Yeah, my lawyer's going to love this. I don't have a good ass time in court. Can you turn that way for me? Can y'all call your superior uh, officer for me first? Please? Turn. Can you please call the superior officer? Please call the superior officer! I didn't do anything wrong. Are you really the sergeant? Can I call my lawyer, please? I did nothing wrong. I did nothing wrong. Please let me call my lawyer. Let me call my lawyer. Are you kidding me? Oh. Hold on, I'm gonna tight do oh. this thing so it doesn't get tight. Hold on, I let me double lock it so it doesn't uh, get tighter. Uh, all right, Miss Nicole, you're gonna sit back in there, okay? No, I request the superior officer before I go. <laughs> okay, did y'all see that in the cameras? <laughs> Are y'all for real right now? Are y'all for real? Dude, why am I criminal? There's criminals out there! And you're arresting me? You f bitch! People are selling drugs! And you arrest me? Wait till my f lawyer ripped your f ass apart! Yeah! He's gonna f ride your f ass by the law! Let me out! Bitch, let me out! Come on! Yo, call the f 
boss. I want superior officer. Right now. No. F I want the superior officer. Hey. Hey. Let me out. Superior officer said, let me out. I request the superior officer right now, and my lawyer says that to you. I request the superior officer right now. Seriously, where is he? On uh, dogs, you have to. Pro you have to call him. You literally have to call him. Yeah, he knows. He knows I'm f***ing right, and if you know my lawyer's gonna have a f***ing field day. I've been talking about my lawyer all f***ing night. Don't talk about me like I don't have one. I REQUEST THE SUPERIOR OFFICER RIGHT NOW! Your mustache is trash, and you're a piece of s***, and I hope some girl shits on your face when she's riding the because you suck no. let me please let me call my lawyer please open the door please let me call my lawyer hey so I want to call my lawyer right do you know his phone number? Play these games. If y'all want to play the games, yo, let me call my f lawyer. You can call him at the jail. Yo, no, please, no. What did I do? When? No! What did I do to get arrested? Are you f kidding me? Wait, wait, no, wait, wait. What? Did I <laughs> what was I doing wrong? Let me out. Oh, you did it again. Okay. I'm looking up that charge right now and you're gonna get charged for it. No, I'm not! Oh, huh? Bring your cop! Bring your superior officer! Again. Please let me out. Are you the are you the superior officer? Yeah, he is. So be nice to him. Be nice to him. Ask them why they put me in here. Why she doesn't there, man. Actually, she'll probably overheard herself, so now we're doing this. Here, I got your other sandal. I love you. Get your other shoe, please. I am trying. I am trying. What are you doing? I'm trying to make sure. It's right here. Is that your lead press on mail there that came off? Yeah, probably. Alright, come on out. Yeah, you know why? Because these officers are very rough with me for oh, no reason. Okay. I don't think they knocked and your nail off. There no, we go. Oh, guess oh, them, oh, ask them what the f did to get locked up in here. Oh. Nothing. Alright. No, wait, no. Can I call my lawyer? No. Huh? Did you ask them? No, I'm the one that wrote There's it. There's foul. There's foul. Okay. There's foul. There's foul. There's foul. Okay. Oh, I didn't okay. do anything. Alright. 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 Okay. Right. 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 I'm sweating on your f***ing back. Hey, what did I do to be disordered? You, you're the one who arrested me? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, this is a real cop car. Are you f***ing No, 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 Top car, and I request my lawyer to be here when this happens. No, I don't know this man now. I want to get kidnapped. What do you mean? I don't know y'all. I don't know y'all. No, I don't know y'all. Uh, okay. okay. Y'all weird. I was molested, and I hope yo come to get you. Come to get you. We don't have one available. Like, same with you, you. Hold up, wait, party.
Right. You're the one pulling away. Why are you doing it, Tom? You're stepping on my foot. Yeah, because you keep kicking. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to stare from the underground. No. Oh, yeah. God. We got some people. Stepping on my whole foot. Well, if you stop kicking, I won't do that. I wasn't. Yes, you were. F you. Wait till my foot. Okay. Go ahead. Damn it. Damn it. Please let me out. You just turned your misdemeanor into a felony. Yeah, because you kicked me. You he kicked, kicked me. Good job. He was flaming my foot. Are you kidding me? You're being ridiculous. I'm kidding. You're being ridiculous. Hey, you can record all you want, that's fine, but don't, in, Yo, don't interrupt our investigation, alright? I'm gonna have a boss. I'm gonna have a boss. Yeah, it's so slow. Yeah, what are Get you okay? Thank you. Are you hurt? So in the end, Karen was charged with disorderly conduct as well as obstructing or resisting an officer without violence. But in court, the disorderly conduct charge was dropped and only the obstructing or resisting an officer without violence charge remained, to which Karen pled not guilty? <laughs> well, I guess she must have said to herself, who am I kidding, and then changed her plea to guilty, at which time she was ordered by the court to pay $529.14 in fines, but she didn't get any jail time, so good for her. On November 17th of 2022, 911 was called because a five-year-old boy had incurred a head injury at a Super 8 motel in New Mexico. Here's what happened as a result of that phone call. Open the door, police department. Do you have a key? Police department, open the door. Where's the kid? What do you mean, where's the kid? Where's That's the my kid? son. I know, okay, where is so he? Wait. Where is he? Stand puppy. Stand puppy. Come here. Come here. Don't uh, bang on the door and scare him. Okay. Is your head hurt? Hello? Hello? Yeah. Okay. 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 Ask him. He wants to look at me. 8-7. Conscious breathing. Yeah. Head gash. Uh, it's not bleeding too bad. You want to hold that here while I hold yes, it? Yes, I will. Where, Mom? Right here. Let me. Yes, sir. Can you hold this for me? Where, Mom? Right here. Just hold it. Right here? Yep. Just push it. <laughs> and then hold this back side. Right there. Where was he playing at? He was playing in the middle and the room. Okay. Tell her, baby. Tell her what happened. Look, she's your friend. It's okay. Tell him. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's good. That's good. Yeah, keep it on there. Don't take it on there. Don't take it on. Tell him. Tell him. You want to sit down? You want to sit on mom? okay? You want to sit on mom's lap? Yeah? Papi, she's stuck in you. Can we um, walk him to the front? You want to um, walk with me to the front? For what? For the med the medical guys are. Can the they come room. over here? Oh, that would be better. I mean, Good. Can, that's her. Pero ella les está diciendo y está como quiera está chewing gum and everything, right? She's calm, mm -hmm. right? Because you're. I mean, I'm sorry, I don't know who you are, but she's treating she's him. Police. And, he's police too. Oh, I know, I know he is, yeah. ma'am, and with all respect, but okay. you, you're you chewing gum and everything, like, he's okay, he's going to be fine when he's lost blood, sir. So, I don't know, yeah, I don't know what's going on, I don't know, I, it's not nothing against you, ma'am, okay. but for me to, for you to be chewing gum and saying, he's okay, and he, if it was your child, ma'am, 
it would be Nani, something different. Nani, Nani, Nani. Yes. Just a little bit. Oh. So they can get to in place. Do so, you mind spitting over? No, ma'am, that's my son. I don't I do mine. Okay. That's my baby. Well, these guys are EMS. Yes, ma'am, and I am his mom. I don't think they mind. Do you okay. guys mind me being here, sir? No. Okay, no. thank you. What happened? Oh. Baby. Nice. What happened? So I just jumping around and then I fell. You fell? Can I look? Yo lo que quiero es, verdad que miren lo que él tiene. Yo como se ve, como que son los dos enemies. Okay. You bite your lip? No. No. Can I do that? It's not gonna hurt. Yeah, it's just water, buddy. It's just gonna pat your you're head. Tough. You're tough. You know you're tough. Can you do it or do you not want to do it? Your mom. It's it's just gonna clean the blood off. It's, it's just water. Will, it's just will you let your mom do it? You want mommy to do? Oh, okay, mommy will do it. It looks like a little gash. No, it doesn't look like a little gash. Yep. Are you are you um? And this is. Because when you shouldn't be on it, it doesn't look like a little gash. Who's more expert than him? I mean... Well, he's a, he's a medic. Can someone else he's come? A professional. Can someone else come? He's yeah. a medic, I mean, ma'am. Ma'am, do you want us to take him to the hospital? Um, yes, because okay. can you see? Yeah, let's go ahead and make our way out to the ambulance. Yeah. We need to do... Yeah. What we need to do is... I'm sorry, it's not against you, sir. Uh -huh. But do you see them? No, yes, ma'am. Of course, I understand that... Here's mother and you're, you're worried about him. No. Can you show us in the in the room? Like what did you do? No, not in the room. I don't think I mean do you guys want to come in the room? Yeah, that's what they're asking. Yeah, we just want to see what he hit. For what? To see what he hit. To he, to see what he hit yes. or he told them. No, I, I didn't call you. They have been way better than you. Okay, but I didn't enough. call. Okay. I didn't call uh, you. My son just hit his head, sir. Get him, get him some clothes, please. I get have been clothes. getting my son some clothes, so no, you don't need to tell me. Ma'am, let's get him some no, clothes. Sir, so we can get him no, sir. No, I can get my son some stuff. That's what I'm. And if not, can you give me some other officer other than him, please? I do not want to do with him. And if I have to do with him, then I'm not gonna do it. So get me someone other than him. Okay, thank you. Don't let her close up the work. No, absolutely not. No, no you're, you're not, not closing open that door. My door. Listen to me. Understand something. Yes, sir. I'm the supervisor tonight. You uh, yes, are extremely sir. intoxicated. No, I am. Home, you're slipped in there. I bet you that bottle was drank tonight. Be careful. Bring your to the door. Okay, listen to me. Okay, I'm going to Here's the deal. We're, we're going to get you your son to the hospital. End the story. We're taking let your son to the hospital. Can let me call someone because you're hey, harassing me. Stop. Your son is going to the hospital. <laughs> Yeah. Let's get your son to the hospital right now. Get me a phone. Okay. And then get your son some clothes and get him to the hospital no. now. Get me Listen to phone. me. Stop. You're intoxicated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And if we have to, we'll take control of your son and get him to the hospital. No, End the story. Yes, ma'am. Stop. Touch my son. Get your son some clothes so we can get you and your son to the hospital. I will you if you touch my son. Get some clothes and get I your son to the hospital you. right now. If you touch my son, I will sue you. I do you're not about give to, you listen, permission. I don't want to detain you to make this happen. I don't give you permission. I don't care. Okay. I don't give you get permission. Get your son to the, the hospital right now. Touch my son. Get your son to the hospital. That is my law that I'm saying. Stop. Right you are making this worse. I don't give you You are making this worse. I don't give you get permission. Get your son some clothes and let's get into the hospital. I don't give you permission listen, to touch my son. Listen to me. Care. You, I don't care. I don't need your permission. I don't care. I don't need your permission. I don't give you permission to touch my son, so Stop. I don't care. You're going to make this so worse for yourself, I don't son. Care. I don't you're going to make this you worse. You are not to touch my listen, son. Listen, listen what you're me. doing. Your son is still bleeding. Don't fight my son. Your son is still bleeding. You. Let's get him to the hospital. Okay, then let's get him to the hospital. Let's go right now. Come don't on. Touch my son. Listen. Go yes, now sir. with him. But I don't give you get permission. Get out of the room and get to the hospital now. Then why don't you do that and get, get out of the room and take your son to the hospital? Then why don't you get an ambulance? They're here. Then why are you arguing with let's me? Let's go. Then why don't you get the Get, get out of the room. Get out, get out of the room way. now. Get, I don't feel comfortable. I'm scared. I'm scared There's and scared. I am not comfortable. Stop. Get I'm out scared. of the room. Listen, we have EMS. Then tell him to get out of my way. I'm scared of him. Get, get out of the room. I'm going to pull you out of that room if I have to. Okay. Get out of the room. Pull me out of this room if you have to. No. So, okay. No. Get your no.
Mom, why would you do this? Why? Get intentional i just think that she was drunk and you know not paying attention because she said that this kid was jumping and fell and hit an end table or something like that so yeah and i and i think that's probably the case he probably was playing around and fell and hit something but even over the phone with uh dispatch like she was refusing to put pressure on it she was wasn't talking and then we get here like she's super confrontational even at ems because he, he has a small gash but it needs attention easy easy get it easy get it Take a deep breath because you have not made this easy. Yes, ma'am, I will be good. I will do everything. You Listen need to me. me right now. Yes, ma'am. Because you are making this worse. Yes, ma'am. Take a deep breath right now. Yes, ma'am. You are going to sit in that car and then we'll tell you what's happening. We're trying to get your son to a hospital. No, ma'am, I'm his mommy. I know you are. I have to be by law. I have to be by him if he's hurt, ma'am. Please. But, uh, yeah, the room is, like I said, it's got trash on the floor, empty beer cans on the floor. Get your camera and start taking photos of this. Yes, sir. Listen to me. What's your first name again? Kiana. Kiana. Officer San Diego. Yes, ma'am. I admit, I drank some drinks right when I'm done with work. Okay, that's Everything fine. Everything right. But under why, understand, why, Kiana. Why is this hold happening? On. Let me talk. My turn, okay? Yes, ma'am. Kiana, the reason why we're here, you called 911. I called you guys. You gave the room number. You said that your child was bleeding, and we did not know what was going on. Yes, okay? yes. So that is Mama, why all the... I need to hold see him, ma'am. That is why all the officers are here. You realize that I can sue you guys for not for, for not letting me see my child, ma'am. Yeah, we, we know. You, you have rights. You have rights. Okay, but we're trying to do our job. I just want to see him, ma'am. He... My baby is literally... You see him, he's hard. Please just let me see him. Man. Let Whatever me you want to do, if I'm in trouble, I will shut the f up and I will do what I gotta do, man. But please let me just know that he's okay, ma'am. He is uh, gonna be fine. <laughs> he's yes. He's okay. Yes, he's gonna okay, be fine. Okay, ma'am, because little kids are little kids. I know they are. Yes. Okay. Okay. All Good. right. Good. Okay. Take a deep breath. No, well, you would take a deep breath if that was your only son. That's my only son. Okay. Okay. I, I, okay, I, I don't it. understand because I don't have kids. Okay. okay. Well, I wish you could, man, because this. Like I said, there's a fifth of fireball that's, you know, 98% drink. Open beer cans everywhere on the floor. Blood on the floor from the kiddo. So... Be the 
No, so she's she's here by herself. So she's new to New Mexico. She works here at the Super 8 as a cleaning lady. So I'm going to read you your rights. Okay. Why? Am just I because being arrested? I just have questions for you. And you're am not, I being arrested? No, but you're detained. You're not free to leave. Okay, so. why am I detained? Because of how you're on acting. video. Because how you're acting inside. How? Why? Because my son is bleeding from his head and you guys are more really worried about getting me in handcuffs and taking care of him. Because, is that why? Because we were okay, trying to get... everything's on video. Yes, okay. it is. We were trying to get you to the hospital okay. with him, but you're being uncooperative. You, oh, you were trying to get me... When did you say you were trying to get me to the hospital? When my supervisor was saying, hey, let's go to the hospital. And yeah. you were arguing back and forth with him. Okay. All right. Is that okay? You were trying to get me to the hospital. Okay. Okay. He went to the hospital. <laughs> okay. So why am I not there at the hospital? That I am his because mother. Because you're acting. But do you have consent for me? Do you have consent? No, you do not. Right. So then you take me to the hospital, or if not, I want my lawyer here and I want everything here because okay. you neither you or them have any consent to take my son to the hospital without me being scared. Okay. So I know you're not the top, but bring the top here. Okay. He's Wherever in, he's inside. But okay, if, you scoot, no. if you scoot back, no, I will not. If you want to force me and strangle me, I don't. Want, that is up to you, ma'am. I don't want to. But force I will you. not leave without here without knowing where my son is. At the cause our medical okay. center. Okay, yes, ma'am. Okay, well, that is that's what you say. Who am I to believe you? I don't even know you, so I want to know where my son is. But it's your badge number, ma'am. <laughs> I don't know what you're asking. You don't know? You don't know? Okay, she's she doesn't know what I'm asking her when I just asked her. No. What am I going to do with my son that is my son, right? That is, he's five years old. He's five years old and she doesn't know. She doesn't know what I'm asking her. Mm -mm. What's your name, Mom? Officer Summon. Officer Summon. Yep. Okay, right? Because you're not Yeah, being roll your eyes. Roll your eyes. Everything's on camera. For real. And if you touch me again, for real, I'm gonna f sue you. Don't you dare f touch me again. Yeah. Anyone else can touch me. Everything's on f video. Oh, it's my baby. How did you not tell me how my baby is? F it, bro. F this, dude. You're gonna f get fired, dude. You're gonna get fired if you don't. Take me to see my son right now. Take me to see my son right now or you're going to get fired. That is my baby. You're not going to take me to see him? You're not going to take me to see him or you're going to get fired? You want to get fired? Yeah? You don't give a Okay, come on, that. You don't give a All right. <laughs> That's my baby. <laughs> don't get scared, girl. I'm not scared. <laughs> <laughs> is she detained or is she 15 or what? Okay. Yeah, okay, so I'm going to see my son. So I know you don't know your name, her name, and everyone else's name. Oh, you for, sure for kidnapping my son from me because that is my son. And you guys, against the law, you guys are kidnapping him from me. Okay, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Sit down in the car. Okay, don't touch me because Sit. I will sue you for touching me. So don't not put your hands on me. Thank you. You're not gonna give it to me? You're not gonna give it to me right now on camera? You're not gonna give it to me? You're not gonna give me my call to my son? You're not gonna give it to me? You're not? Look at me and tell me you're not. You're not gonna give me my call to my son? You guys are kidnapping my son. Yes, sir. I wanna pr I wanna make a report mm -hmm. for kidnapping my son. Okay, we didn't kidnap your son. No, no, well, I don't give no consent. Okay, I can't, I give no, no. We don't it's need not. Your I don't care. It's not okay, about you. Is? It's because everyone has rights, just like you. I have rights too. Okay. So just like my son is in the hospital mm -hmm. without me, okay. so I wanna press charges on him and her. You, I believe my you for kidnapping my son. Okay. And that's what I want to do. Okay, and well, I have rights, so give me a report. We, give we me have, a report. Well, listen, I don't need it. Yeah, I don't need to listen to you. Okay, then give step me, in the car, please. Okay, We're, well, then you give don't me. Listen, then okay, gonna then you're going to kidnap my son? We're not kidnapping your son. Yes, you are. No, that's to me. Not. You are. No, to not. me, you are. Okay. I am the mother, no. and you are kidnapping my okay. son. If you don't want to listen to me, then I need you to put Then are you kidnapping Are you sure? So the consequences. Tell me earlier we're going to have to force her in the car. No, ma'am. Really? Are we going to have to force you in the car? He was I understand saying, that, but I'm saying that you're extremely intoxicated. 
No, how am I? How do you know? How do I know? Because I've been doing this job for a while. You can't okay, even talk Okay, well, straight. good for you. Really? You and I don't straight. need a talk to you. I am at my own home. Uh -huh. I am by myself. And you guys and, come. And you're to the point and where your son became hurt on the no, your watch. No, 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 no. You became no, argumentative. You that, didn't want to take to me, to the hospital. That, to me, you can be sued by that. Okay, we're going to take your son to the hospital for you. Okay. We're going to get your son Well, let me see my baby. Because I am not going to step in. Let me see my baby, sir. Okay, you're still at the hospital. Sir, really? Getting the help he needs. But sir, that's my baby. I understand that. But sir. And had you been less argumentative sir, and more helpful, um, this wouldn't have happened. So if I was less argumentative, uh -huh. then you would have let me see my son. No, we would have already been at the hospital. Okay, you with your son getting the help please, he needs. Okay, sir, let Listen, me see the my... fact that you were stopping us from getting the help Sir, your son how needs. is the fact you guys took an hour to get here? No, we didn't. You, yes, you did. You I have the, everything. Okay, you called I have us everything. and we were okay, here five minutes later. Let me see my baby, sir. We were sir. here five um, minutes later. Okay, sir. Okay, okay. If yes, you sir. waited an hour to okay, call, yes, sir. that's your fault. Are you yes. listening? So yes. we're going to call the Central White Office <laughs> Intake for Child Youth and Family Services Division, oh. okay? Yes. All right, we're okay. going to be requesting a okay. caseworker to come out and okay. take and what about child. And what about my family? Because okay. he's scared. If you're when that scared of... When your family If you're here, scared of how he is, why don't talking. you call... No, you... Stop talking. If you're you scared of how he is, why don't you call my dad to be with him? Okay. That is well, not we're right, ma'am. Ma'am, you're a woman. That is not right, ma'am. That is not right. If I am wrong, let me be wrong. But that is my dad. That's his grandpa, sir. Uh, I, I agree. That with is you. not right for you to. <laughs> That's not We're right, sir. Your son to help do whatever I have to pay. I will go and I will do it, sir. But please no, let are. my son. Why? Why at the moment when my son is bleeding? I thought you care about my son. We do. That's why he's so at the hospital. Him, why the f are you here talking? Why are you here talking, sir? Your son you... is at the hospital. Okay, so why are you here arguing? Because you That's not right, ma'am. You don't have kids. You roll your eyes, dude. So where come is a bro? Karma is a for whatever it is. Karma is a dude. And take me, take me, but whatever your name and his name and you, I'm sorry, but you're not doing nothing about it. I'm to all your and that's it. Yeah, yeah, roll your eyes. Get the out of my face. Get in the car. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Get me in the car. Get me in the car. Touch me and get me in the car. Touch me and get me in the car. I'd really prefer not to. So okay, well, do car. it. Do it. So get I can in. have more on video. Do it. Do it. I'm not hurting anyone. Do it. Get me in the car. Get me in the car. You guys already have enough. Do it. I'll let her do it. That's kidnapping. Where's my baby? Where's my baby, sir? Where's my baby? Where's my He's baby? At the Where is my baby? I don't care. Where is my baby? Call my lawyer. Thomas J. Henry. Call him right now. Thomas J. Henry. Call him right now because I am not going to go in this yeah. Yeah. car. What? Call my lawyer. Call my lawyer. I have, that's what lawyers are for. Call right. my lawyer. You'll, you'll, you'll get your chance. Yeah, no. Right now. Save your job and save your job for real before y'all both get fired dude okay. all right all right baby. all right listen that's my baby okay i understand this is oh, very dude. intense situation we just need you to just listen to us and work with sir us. really if you cooperate with us it's gonna be awesome am... either okay okay so, all right, so if I just get in the car no please, please no car. no call my lawyer call my lawyer i want to see my lawyer right now thomas right, yeah, j yeah. henry thomas j henry call my lawyer yeah Call my lawyer. Call my lawyer. Hey, okay, so you're not gonna call my lawyer. You're under arrest now for resisting. Call okay? my lawyer, sir. You're under arrest for resisting. Get in the call car. my lawyer. Get in the car. Scoot your feet in the car, please. Ow! Ow! Owie! 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 Kiana. Okay, well, where the f is my baby? You... That is my kid, and you kidnapped him from me. That is what that is called by 
block. You're you asking, know. but you're yelling, so I can't speak. Man, because if they took your baby, what would you do? What would you do? That's my baby. What would you do? What would you do? That's my son. He's fine. It's, it's not if you want to, ma'am. It's by law. Okay. It's by law. If that was your son, I'm sorry to be rude, but you guys okay. want me to the same. And that was your son. This way. Stick them in the room. Do that. You do it. Now. No, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna put my hands in my hands. I'm dirty. No, please don't put my hands in my hands. I'm dirty. No, please don't put my hands in my hands. I'm dirty. No, please don't put my hands in my hands. I'm dirty. No, please don't put I heard you guys, and then she asked me, "What, what, what, I, what I do?" And I say, "Do you know what, daughter? Just take it to the hospital." Right. She goes, "I don't have, I don't have a ride, dad, or nothing." And I say, "You can ask for help, Mika. I already told her that we're trying to get her back to Texas. Right. We're gonna get some money. Right. We're gonna try to buy the the tickets, and then I told her, "What's the use of you being over there? You don't, you don't have nobody over there. Right. You know, you went with your boyfriend. It didn't work out. You know, just." So and I'm a truck driver, ma'am. I'm a truck driver, okay. and I'm out of out of being a passenger, not working. Right, right. I understand. I I, I really appreciate your help, ma'am. Really, yes, sir. I, I, and and I, I, I feel a little bit. I feel the. I feel my heart pounding of joy that you called me, but I'm also worried because no, yes, I don't know where she's at or nothing. You know. No, so the child is at. So the child is at the hospital with another officer. What? Hey, Kiana. I just got off the phone with your dad. Okay. So he's he's aware of what's going on. Hey, listen, can you hear me? He's aware of what's going on, okay? He's going to come and get the baby, but he lives... You want to open it? You want to open it? Yeah. I don't think she'll do anything. Hey. Hey, Kiana. Okay, I need you to, I need you to relax, okay? All right. Okay, hold on. He's at the medical center. All right? So here, here's what's gonna happen. Are you ready, are you ready to listen? I just got off the phone with your dad, okay? Mario, correct? But depending on to you, what you do right now, okay? Why, what am I being? You're what being am arrested. I being detained for? No, you're not detained. You're under arrest. So, so why? why? You are here in the jail. So I'm just going to talk to you about what's going to happen. So do you want to know what happens to your kid or not? I want to know. Okay, then stop talking. Stop really? talking. Really? Don't talk to me later. Okay? So you're nothing. If I want to know what happens to my kid, we got it from here. That's fine. As a result of Karen's inability to follow simple instructions, she was charged with resisting arrest.